Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Queen America and we are back with another video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We are going to go on a tours in the area of University City in Charlotte, North Carolina. So let's get right into the video because I'm not about to waste your time. All right, guys, the first apartment is what's called Wellen. And this was in the University City area. I did, I wasn't sure how I felt about the unit, like the having separate units in different buildings versus it, it being one big building. Um, so that was just like my only weird takeaway from that. I like the hallways. I love how the light fixture on the side with the, the apartment number. Um, I thought that was cute. It smelled really good in the hallway, which means a lot to me personally. <laughs> this is the first unit that we walked into. I love the cabinet cabinets. Um, I love the colorway in here. I love the island in the middle. Like it was just given. I had a little work area in the corner. I love that. Um, this is a good size for me because I'm moving alone. I'm not moving with nobody. I got no kids, none of that. So um, I really enjoyed the fact that it was like not too big, but also not too small. Also, there's a stack of washer and dryer. Those are pretty small. So I'm like, I won't be able to fit a lot of clothes in there. But again, it's just me. So like, why would I need so much space? I like how the bedroom had a carpet. And then there was a walk-in closet as well. Oh, this is the bathroom. I love the double sinks, the fixtures, like the finished touches, like the black trim around the um, mirror stuck out to me, which I really love that. Um, it just made it more welcoming. And then also too, like the black trim on the shower door was super cute. And I like how they had like little cubbies in the shower where I could store my products and hopefully water wouldn't get in that area um, for the shower. I did wish that this unit did have a tub though. Um, and then this was the walk-in closet. I love how they have shelving in there and double shelving. Um, and then also there was a bit extra behind the, behind the door. So a lot of the units in Charlotte does have walk-in closets. I love all the cabinet space in there. Like there was no cabinet that was that could not have been used. And that was that whole apartment. I like that first unit. This was the second unit that we went to. The only difference between this unit and the other unit was I think the position of this of the kitchen. That was all. And I love the fixture. Like the light fixture was everything to me. Now the pool area looked really nice. Um, it's giving modern, it's giving new, it's giving fresh. Not to mention that it's open 24 seven all year long is insane. Then we walked into the clubhouse, which is also open 24 seven. I can enter this area anytime I would like. I just love the aesthetics in here. It's just giving very much. I'm like, oh yes, content, content, content. Um, they had uh, like complimentary waters over there in the fridge. Um, that's where that lady was over there showing me that I could use that stuff and then we went upstairs um oh around the corner there's another like sitting area it was just so pretty um I just love the whole vibe here but I feel like you know how like apartments be having these common spaces but nobody really be in them um which I feel like is an opportunity for me to actually utilize it <laughs> But yeah, I love the vibe in here. It was so cute. And then walked over into the gym, one of my favorite areas. Okay, this was the cardio room. Um, so they had like cycling, you know, the treadmills and things like that. It was small and then walked into the, the weight room. I love how there's a mirror over there, the TV in the way for me. Um, but yes, they had, it's like, it looked very spacious in there, um, which I did appreciate. The grass outside? Oh, I'm like, yes, once it get warm outside again, I'll be out there doing my lunges. It's giving. It's giving. Not to mention that beautiful view over the pool area. It's just like a breath of fresh air. Moving on to apartment number two called Heather Ridge, y'all. <laughs> So 
So this was the common space in that area. I thought it was cute with the, you know, it was very different with all the colors. And then you walk over into the pool area. It wasn't nothing too special about it. I don't think the, oh no, the feet, well, it went up to five feet. But yeah, I wasn't like too, I wasn't too hype over this pool area. And then the apartment buildings were outside. So, of course, the apartment buildings outside. The apartment unit's front door is outside. Walking into it was very small. There's no island. I'm, I'm just already like, ugh, I should have came here first. <laughs> but um, after leaving Welland, I was just like, yeah, nah, I'm not feeling this. The kitchen's small. I love to cook, meal prep. Um, I appreciate the larger um, washer and dryer for sure. But I didn't like that I had to share um the space with i guess whatever that big machine thing is in the corner um they did have closet space which i did appreciate it was very tight in there moving over to the bathroom i just felt like they literally just updated the fixtures which looked kind of tacky to me in my opinion and look you know me i'm in the fashion industry so i'm looking at every detail i'm like ugh, yeah nah i'm okay this was very much like last resort because they said that it was updated modern like when the, the, on the description of their website renovated units and I'm like y'all literally just replaced it some fixtures in the bathroom and call it updated nah the bedroom was a decent size it was the same size around like around the same size as the other unit um and then the walk-in closet was very small. I'm not gonna hold you. Wellen had me head over heels. Moving on to the third apartment. Bird at McCullen. First of all, y'all, the common spaces in Bird. I was just like, yeah, what? The pool tables, the kitchen area, the common kitchen area, um, the lounge area. It was just so nice. And the guy was very professional. Um, I just love the whole vibe in here. It just felt so warm. It smelled amazing. And let me tell you something. When you move, especially from the city areas all the time, like up north, if the hallway don't smell nice, <laughs> that's a bad sign. Now, anyway, we went on outside, first of all. I just love how all the units are all in one big building. Um, the common space outside in the back. Like, mind you, the pool area is open 24-7, if I'm not mistaken. They had a whole pool table outside, y'all. The grill areas, like, it's just about sitting areas. You can have a lot going on out here. Um, I like how the pool is still gated. Um, now, these common areas, look at the little fireplace area. You can do s'mores out there. Do not play with them. They really had me extremely impressed. Um, and then there was other lofty areas um, on the side, like, throughout the building now moving inside what was it the fitness center y'all i'm not gonna hold you the fitness center is that it's it was just heck you can have a good view outside see what's going on then this big old wall this mirror girl i'll be watching my lunges i'll be watching my, my i'm talking about lunges i hate lunges my squats my deadlifts yes now they did not have a lot of machines i don't think welland didn't either but this was so nice walking over to the yoga studio it's just very clean you have the area a cubby area to store your things at another great big mirror which i appreciate i was, fell in love with the gym they just didn't have like an outside area like well indeed which i did appreciate from well um and then walking the hallway it smells so good y'all The front doors of the apartments were just so nice. Um, welcome to the first unit. I didn't really like the fixtures in there, like the the um, light fixtures. I thought it was ugly. The cabinet color, I wasn't the biggest fan of, but there is so much cabinet space. Um, it looks a bit larger than Wellen, and I love how it also had a balcony. Now, I'm not too crazy for a balcony, but I mean, hey, sure, I will take it. Why not? Especially when there's a view of the beautiful pool area. Do not play with me. Do not play. Don't play with her. 
<laughs> that was so cute. I'm not going to hold you. The hardwood floor was just a pre very nice. Um, I don't mind the gray cap, like the gray doors. Um, I love how the refrigerator had a water filter. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Now, the stairs is another stackable washer and dryer. I don't think those are actually like big, but they are good size for me. The bedroom was a bit interesting. Like the shape of the bedroom was interesting. I was trying to see how, how the heck my bed gonna fit in here. Love the closet space. I just wish there was like a second rack. Um, but it was a good size, like as far as in walk-in closet, but I do believe well it has them be not gonna hold you. Moving on into the bathroom. I love the double sinks. I just wish that they had finished like thick like finished touches that made things stand out, like there was no trim around the mirror, like Wellen had a little basic for me. They had garages on every level where I could just park my car in the garage and just walk over to my building. I don't have to step, like go up the stairs or nothing. Moving on to our last apartment tour of the day called Pros. I was so impressed, y'all. This was such a large space. It was beautiful. Now there's not as much cabinet space in the kitchen, which was okay because baby, how much space do I really need? All new appliances. I think they just built this one. So I would have been the first um person to live in this unit it was on the first floor which i do not mind the living room was larger than all units we've toured today the bedrooms was so big love 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 i think all units had a ceiling fan if i'm not mistaken and then the bathroom it wasn't too bad y'all just one sink and i'm like ugh the cabinet space um there was decent the shower i wasn't that impressed with the tub i did appreciate but it just looked i don't know i didn't really like it now the closet space yes like do not play that's a full walk-in closet right there on the bathroom was very spacious and i love the white doors i could not complain about that this was a beautiful unit and y'all i almost signed the lease at bird i literally almost on the least like i put, applied for this unit got the unit this was my birthday unit it was 207 y'all i was like god you want me to move here so that's what i'm gonna do <laughs> now that's the exact i my friend go to her for me the exact unit that i've been moving into because i do not play when you looking for apartments please make sure you tour the exact units before signing a lease baby now i hope you guys enjoyed this Comment down below which unit, which apartment, which building, which parts of whatever apartment that you liked down below. Um, if you are new to the city, hit me up. If you are interested in moving, whether it's to Charlotte, North Carolina, or just anywhere new, let me know. Let's have a conversation down in the comments. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And always and forever embrace your journey. I love you. I'll see you in the next one.